One of the most important resources on Earth is water, as it is essential to life. Despite this fact, our natural water bodies, such as rivers, lakes, and seas, are seriously threatened by increasing pollution. Water pollution refers to the polluting of the Earth's water bodies. Oceans, seas, lakes, rivers, and underground waters caused by human activity. Pollution is a change in the physical, chemical, or biological properties of water, which has a harmful impact on the flora and fauna. The main sources of water pollution are industry, agriculture, and urban areas. Our waters can be severely polluted by mining and transportation of the extracted materials, as well as industrial activities. Approximately 500 million kilograms of oil spills into seas from container ships every year. Oil that gushes into oceans during tanker accidents can lead to major environmental disasters in the affected area. Also, another 500 million kilograms of oil seeps into waters each year from factories, farms, and built-up areas. Radioactive waste is a byproduct of uranium mining, nuclear plants, scientific research, and the medical industry. Due to radiation, radioactive waste can pose a threat to surface and underground waters for thousands of years. Acid rain is caused by industrial complexes and vehicles that emit sulfur oxides and nitrogen oxides. Acid rain can damage the environment far from the source of the emissions. Agriculture uses 70% of all the water used on Earth, so it is one of the main water polluters. Every time it rains, chemicals, pesticides, and animal fertilizers are washed into our waters. Nutrient pollution caused by the excessive presence of nitrogen and phosphorus in air and water leads to a growth in the algae population with a detrimental effect on water quality. As a result, the water becomes turbid and light cannot reach the bottom of the lake, thus killing aquatic plants. This process uses up the oxygen in the water, causing the death of other species as well. Oil pollution in water bodies is partly caused by oil leaking from millions of vehicles day by day. Urban areas also produce a lot of waste. Plastic waste in our waters can cause major environmental damage. More and more floating waste islands can be observed in our rivers, lakes, and seas. Plastic waste poses a threat to aquatic ecosystems. It might cause animals to drown or starve to death. 80% of wastewater produced by households and industrial, commercial, and agricultural activities return to natural water bodies without being purified or recycled. Chemicals and heavy metals in wastewater can be poisonous to aquatic wildlife. There are a whole lot of things you can do to protect the Earth's natural water bodies. First of all, use fewer plastic products. Instead of plastic containers, use glass ones. And instead of plastic bags, use reusable cloth bags. Drink tap water instead of bottled water. Collect used cooking oil in selective containers. And last but not least, use fewer chemicals in your garden and household. The protection of waters requires a greater awareness on the part of the whole society. To prevent diseases from spreading through water, water quality should be checked on a regular basis. More attention should be paid to the purification and recycling of wastewater. By reducing deforestation, the purity of our waters can be preserved as well. As agriculture uses most of the water on Earth, it must make a proportionate effort to protect our waters. <laughs>